you guys voted for it, so in this video, I'm going to be continuing my Prime Energy Drink Review series with the second flavor, and that flavor is... Tropical, Tropical Punch. Punch. Let's do this thing. Before this video starts, I would just like to say that if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more videos like this, then smash the like button, subscribe if you haven't yet subscribed, and check out the other videos on this channel. I think you might like them. But with that said, let's not waste any time. Let's get into this review. So we got the can of the drink right here. And let me just say, I really like the glossy finish that it has. And I'm a sucker for red, so this can, it just looks, it looks beautiful. It may not have a lot of design to it, but God, that red color, it's so vibrant. It just pops out at you. Just like with the last flavor, it has 200 milligrams of caffeine, it's vegan, and it has 300 milligrams of electrolytes, so yeah, this is healthy, I guess. It pretty much has the same nutrition facts too, 10 calories, 0 grams of fat, 55 milligrams of sodium, 3 grams of carbs, 0 grams of sugar, and 0 grams of protein. When I reviewed the blue raspberry flavor, I was pleasantly surprised because I don't usually like low calorie or zero calorie energy drinks, or zero sugar for that matter, but the blue raspberry flavor was pretty good. So hopefully the tropical punch flavor is just as good, if not better. So let's crack this bad boy open and see what we're dealing with. And since I'm doing a review video, I gotta be pretty thorough, so we're pouring it into this nice mini Starbucks mug. It's tea time! Only replace the tea with prime. I guess you could say it's prime time. <laughs> I'm not funny. Let's pour it. Okay. Ooh. There's a lot of uh, bubbles sparkling off of the top of the drink. I don't know if you can see that. I don't think it's coming up on camera, but when I first poured it, it was, it was sizzling. Like a glizzy on a frickin' barbecue. Now, if you watched the Blue Raspberry review, you would know that when I poured it into the cup, it had a slight blue tinge to it, but for the most part, it looked pretty clear. For this one, I'm not seeing any red tinge at all. It's just completely clear. I mean, the lighting that I have in this room right now kind of makes it have a little bit of a cloudy look, but... That shouldn't be bad. If anything, the cloudy look is coming from the coconut water that's in the drink, so... We should be fine. I'm sure Logan Paul and KSI didn't use, like, muddy water they found in a ditch. At least I hope not. But anyway, let's try it. Prime Energy Tropical Punch flavor, down the hatch. The aftertaste does have a slight tropical punch flavor, so it's not false advertising there. Doesn't really have that bad of an aftertaste either, so it's just like its blue raspberry counterpart. It's not too bad. It kind of has the same aftertaste to that, um, what was it? I think it was that whipped strawberry rockstar that I did a review of a while back. It has a similar aftertaste to that, somewhat. Yeah, it's actually not bad. I'm not gonna lie though, I don't know if this is better or if the blue raspberry is better. I feel like it's a pretty close tie. Let's see if drinking it out of the can gives any different results. Yeah, not really. Yeah, no new results there. I would say on a scale of 1 to 10, 1 being this drink is absolute dog water, just like how it looked with the cloudy the cloudy liquid 10 being this is the best energy drink ever i would say this is about the same as what i gave the blue raspberry like a 7 7.5 maybe an 8 i would say a 7.9 so not quite an 8 but pretty pretty close yeah it's not bad not bad at all logan paul ksi you have a good drink here very refreshing i might add I have a feeling if I drank this before a workout at the gym or something, I would definitely feel pumped up. I mean, hell, you gotta have a lot of energy when you go to a gym because shit, that stuff is gnarly. 
And judging by my muscle mass, I think I could use a trip to the gym. I could use some more protein. But yeah, that's basically it for this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, like I mentioned at the beginning, smash the like button. And comment down below what flavor of Prime Energy you want me to review next. I recently got my hands on the orange flavor and the watermelon flavor, if I remember right. So comment down below which ones out of those you want to see me review next. And with that said, hopefully you guys enjoyed. And I will see you lovely people back at it again next time with another video. Until then, this is Cyan Dragon signing out. Bye!